Okay, welcome to another edition of Ask Guy. Today, we're going to discuss the difference between 45 degree SAE and 37 degree SAE. Customer service has asked me how can we determine when somebody calls us on the phone without actually seeing the fitting what they have in their hand. The first question that I ask a customer typically on the phone is what material is the adapter? If they say brass, there's a 98% chance that if they think it's a 37 degree fitting, it's not, it's 45 degree. Brass is commonly used as a 45 degree flare fitting. If they say steel, the opposite applies. It's typically a 37 degree steel fitting. Now, if you're lucky enough for your customer to have an angle with him or a gauge that clearly says 45 degree on one, 37 on the other, it's very simple to use this gauge. It, you're looking for it to be straight up and down. So if you can see there, the angle and the gauge is straight up and down sitting on a 45 degree seat. If you do this with a 37 degree, as you can see, you can't quite get this 45 degree to be level. So you go to the other side, and now you got a clean break, nice and flush, straight up and down. One other thing that you should know about JIC and SAE 45 degree. The reason the seat angle is so important is because in sizes two, three, four, five, eight, and 10, the threads on these fittings are exactly the same. So if you're not sure of whether it's 37 degree or 45 degree, they will still meet mate with a female, but they won't seat properly and you'll create a leak problem. That's it for today. Please put your questions below or something else you'd like to know about hydraulics and I will do a video. Thank you.